Now to a growing danger on the highway for you and your family this summer. We're talking about trailers, the kind used to haul everything from boats to mulch. An expert at Purdue University says he's concerned about this danger that kills hundreds every year. Cossack's investigator Kara Kenny has been digging into the issue of highway safety over the past year and has the latest. You may notice them, you may not. Trailers hauling everything from equipment to motorcycles to landscaping supplies. Fred Whitford of Purdue University has studied transportation for the last 15 years and calls these trailers a growing problem on Indiana highways. It's not a potential, it's real. Every day I get reports of these trailers coming off. And when they do, if you can imagine a flying missile. Whitford points to statistics that show more than 300 people die nationwide in crashes involving trailers each year. Nearly 10,000 are injured annually. Earlier this summer, a New York family of seven died after a truck's trailer became unhitched. Do you think most people are aware of this danger? On this end here, the answer is no. And it's not that people are stupid or they, they want to do anything wrong. Is that they just don't know. Whitford demonstrated the common mistakes drivers make, including hauling loads that are too heavy for the trailer, not using chains. They won't put a pin in it. And not properly securing their loads with ties and straps. Once it comes out, you're going to react to that on the ground. This year, the Call 6 investigators have exposed highway dangers such as inadequate underride guards on semi trucks and what some call a lack of state inspectors who look for overweight trucks and unsecured loads. Whitford says trailers on small trucks and SUVs are often overlooked by police and other drivers. In the state of Indiana, there is no annual required inspection through a government facility like in some states. Indiana State Police says trailers on commercial vehicles are required to document an annual inspection performed by the company or a mechanic. And even if it's not a commercial vehicle like this one, police can still stop and enforce certain laws, such as leaky load. So what's a driver to do? Woodford says keep your eyes peeled for trailers and be ready to move. If you see things that are not tied down, or you, you've seen them, they wobble. You can see furniture moving, mattresses moving, then you need to back off or get around. Kara Kenny, RTV6. And Woodford says if you plan on hauling something, check your owner's manual and the stickers on your hitch and trailer to make sure you're carrying a safe amount of weight. And you can read his studies on our website, theittychannel.com.